Holy shit. I never had you down as a game geek. There's a lot more about me you don't know. I'm full of surprises. You'll see. We need to get moving. I can't believe Taylor's gone. Fuck. We need to get away from here. Let's check that out. It'll get us out of these damn woods, and we can talk on the way. Believe it. This ain't happening. Taylor's gone. I'm such a fucking asshole. I could have saved her. It was obvious she really cared about you. There's got to be a way out. Maybe stopping that kid, ending the trials. I don't know. We don't know for sure that stopping Mary will help us out. It's just a theory. It may only be a theory, but right now it's all we've got. Come on, let's take a look.
Check this out. Hey! They're coming. You can't keep running. I'll make sure they'll find you. That guy's a menace. I don't think he gets how bad a mess we're in. Come on, inside. Well, no one's been here for a long time. <laughs> my time to speak before the judge. I am filled with dread. I cannot know how my testimony will be received. The devil has blinded so many to what is real and what is not. Nothing good will come of this. His words will seek to twist the truth. Allow me to judge what is true. Abraham and Joseph are allies in this deception. And lest we forget, you condemned Joseph to death only yesterday. Or do you now question that decision? I have heard nothing today to sway my conviction. Joseph consorted with the same malicious force as his wife. For this, the court thanks Reverend Carver, who faced the devil's wrath to present the evidence. It is only my duty, Judge. Now, however, this court is duty-bound by law to seek out the truth. We must therefore examine these claims made by Abraham against Mary. If I may speak briefly, Judge Wyman. Time is short, Reverend. Be indeed brief. Mary has shown great fortitude to speak out against the evil here. Many would have lacked her courage. Yet her reward for exposing this brooding covered in our midst is to be besmirched. Her courage is not in question. It is her intent we must be certain of. Her accuser is the very man entrusted to care for this innocent child. Plain to see he is not fit for such a task. And I would ask the court to have Mary placed elsewhere. Who would you have be her new ward, Reverend? I am prepared to take responsibility for the child. If the court agrees. First, the court must hear what Abraham has to say. No decision can be made on the child until then. Abraham! I do not know which course to take. My conscience tells me. I must speak out against Mary, but it weighs heavy on my heart to do so. You've got to tell the judge everything. That girl is evil. Everyone needs to know it. Tell the court what you have come here to say. Speak up, boy. Out with it! Mary has spoken of evil spirits, devilry and witchcraft. Things many cannot believe could exist here in the I'm not here for history and hearsay. Get to the point, boy. Mary confessed to me all her accusations were false. She did not see what she claimed. There was no witchcraft. There were no familiars, no devils. All were just the imaginings of a child's mind. You understand the gravity of your testimony. Yes, George, I do. Very well. You may step down. Mary is to remain with me. Given your testimony, I feel the child must go elsewhere. The Reverend Carver will be Mary's new charge by order of the court. Tell me everything. Did you see Andrew's double again? Yeah, we saw him. He told the judge that Mary made it all up. None of what she said was true. Okay, so now what? This helps us. Has to. We now know for sure that we can alter what happens. You agree with him? Maybe I'm being dumb, but I don't get how we, or anyone, can change something that happened hundreds of years ago. Normally, I'd agree with you, but we can see these events. Somehow they're running parallel to us, so 
I think we can change him. What the fuck? We can't stay. Let's get out of here. Get over here. You gotta see this. This is too fucking weird. <sighs> this is too much. Way too fucking much. First, a load of weirdo witch killers from ancient history look just like us. Now, we got the creepy family of the year winners who also look just like us. What the actual fuck? What does it mean, though? Do you think they died like the other lookalikes? No clue. Who knows what happened to them? Maybe we're all stuck in the same nightmare. You really want a souvenir? From this night? From this place? All I know, I'm keeping hold of this. What you said about all this being a nightmare. You mean that? It's my nightmare. Why are you guys all in it? Any of us could say the same thing. I don't know what's real here. Are you the real Andrew? Oh, come on. So wait. Who are those people in the photograph? Maybe time is fucked up here. <laughs> you hear that? Right below us. We need to find a way out of here. Now. That's heavy. Andrew, get your ass over here and help me out. What's up? You take that side, I'll take this side. Push together, right? Good. Now, push! Whoa! Oh, shit! Ah! Hey, are you okay down there? It's over. He's gone.
That thing looks to have gone, but it could come back any time. We have to keep moving. In the fog there. You see that? Stay on your toes. Anything could happen. While you still draw breath, Joseph. You must die today. Not even your wife Amy was spared your lust to serve Satan. Damn me if you must. You're not fit. Speaking of my late wife. There is still fight in you. I must drive the devil out for the safety of everyone here. Oh, no one is safe. Joseph, do you renounce the devil and all his teachings? I carry no sin. I'm no disciple of the devil. Our town is infected with madness. Roy, you but saints, servants. We have to stop this. Get away! You give me that! Look! See how this poor child is tormented. Joseph still clutches her with the devil's hand. More stones! The devil must be crushed from within him! Do not flinch! The fate of little Orc rests in your hands! We're screwed. There is no way out from this nightmare. We don't have a lot of time. Look, John! John, get away from it! I'm done running! Time for payback for Taylor and Daniel! Are you crazy? We gotta move! Come on, you fuck! I'm ready!
I need you here. I can't do this on my own. You gotta come with me. Don't move. Is it gone? I don't see it anymore. We need to figure a way out of here before that thing finds a way in. Place looks like it burned down. Something here isn't right. You're gonna wanna see this. This is for real? Angela and I were married. What's that noise? My guess is the girl. We need to find her. She's in here. What do you think you're doing? It's okay. Trust me.
No, wait. You protect me. You must. Wait, this isn't right. No way. I assure all gathered here today that our town will be free of the devil's grasp. Together, by God's grace, little hope will prevail. My word on it. This court is hastily convened, but with good reason. If we are to finally rid ourselves of the evil which has infested Little Hope, then we must act today. I accuse you, Mary, of witchcraft. What say you, Reverend? The evidence, as discovered through my investigation, is beyond question. Mary uses her poppet as a familiar to summon and serve the devil. We have been deceived by a child, by her guise of innocence. This puppet was mistakenly used to denounce Tabitha, but it has always belonged to Mary and Mary alone. She allowed her own kin to be executed as she watched in silence. That is not so. Liar! Now this tin child, this creature of Satan has the marrow to accuse me, a man of God, of wrongdoing. Don't buy into her act. That kid can't be trusted. We got her denounced. We have to see what happens. It was never my intention to bring harm to this town or its people. Can you not help me? What can I do? If I could do something to stop this, I would, but now in her hour of greatest need, I this child of the damned pleads once more for the Wait. devil's help. I beg the court's indulgence. Please guide me at this time. This seek your counsel. No question there's something very wrong here. Right in the heart of this place. There can be no doubt that Little Hope is afflicted. That darkness has taken hold of our town. There is not a man or woman here today who does not already know the devil is in our midst. The sole purpose of this court is to remove evil, not indulge it further. Our time is not for wasting. He's right. Mary's behind all this. How do I make my decision? If I am wrong, I condemn an innocent to die. The only way I can see out of this is to get rid of that damn doll. Destroy that and... The puppet must be cast asunder. Maybe this all goes away. It is the cause of Mary's affliction. It holds her in its thrall. Destroy this puppet, and the devil will depart Mary. She will be restored, an innocent child. Reverend, burn the puppet. Destroy it. You must not act in haste. The girl must face the full consequences of My her deeds. My authority is not for questioning. Do as I ask. the way it's meant to, there's nothing more you can do now. Is that the end of it? I'm not sure about that. I could have just made things a whole lot worse. It's over. We can leave.
thought you'd be here. Leave me alone, will ya? I've lost everything. You've lost everything? Are you kidding me? Just get out of here. Go away! You should have stayed away. I'll never forget or forgive you for what you did. There he is! There's a fucking killer! You mean Angela? That was an accident. I thought she was one of those things. You seem a little confused. traffic through Little Hope. You okay, buddy? You seem a little confused. Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Just shut up! This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. Hi there. How you doing? Excuse me, but we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? That's funny. Sounds like you could use a drink. Better not, thanks. I need to keep a clear head. Motherfucker, you! You take a goddamn shot at me! Quit hiding in there! Get away from here! Go! You're you're in real danger! I know! From you! You'll regret it big time if you don't leave right now! Get out here and face me like a man, you chicken shit! Hey! They're coming! I don't think he gets how bad a mess we're in. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again, see if you can get a different result. That's the problem with demons. If you don't lay them to rest, they will haunt you forever. Not a very happy ending. Or maybe it is. Depends on what makes you happy, really. And you eventually found him. The bus driver. Maybe he can now put the past behind him.
until we meet again, maybe in the South Pacific, or the Arabian Desert, or somewhere else. But we will meet again, at least one more time. Absolutely not. We'll start believing. We are under attack by... I don't know what. You wouldn't believe me even if I tried. Hell, I don't believe in how it's there. In Sumerian myth, they say the souls of the dead went deep underground to the House of Ashes. Where they lived on dust and plagued by the demons of the underworld. 